like to look after the guys, so I might as well give them somewhere to live. Yeah, of course. Well, it's um, not like you've imported them yourself, is it? No, exactly that, like yeah. I was saying to you. you know, they're, they're all it's still a theory, you know, some madness to it. Um, it's the beauty of running over filtration, you know, it's a massive koi field. Yeah, it's huge. So we just filmed his uh, nine foot tank in the house. Now we're going to go out, he's got a, let me just show you. There's a pond out here which has got some crazy bits in, so let's go check it out. Right, this is crazy, man. Yeah, so it's tacky as hell, but then you look in it and it's really cool. Yeah, it and is I've cool, isn't it? I've got split emotions on it, because I look at it from a distance and I think, what the hell is, what is, the hell is that in my garden? And then you look at them. Yeah. And that is sick. absolutely ridiculous fish. Um, so yeah, they're, they're gator guys, there's four of them in here. Um, that is every bit of 25 inches, that fish. Yeah, that is a big fish, man. Um, it makes it look small in here, though, doesn't it? It's but if, great. You, if you get it out. Man, that came from a five by two by two. Yeah. It was in Kieran's tank for a little period of time. Um, it was very aggressive at 28 degrees, which they always are. Um, I wouldn't keep them anywhere near tropical. No. No. Because they're just absolutely sad. Like, if I put those four fish in that tank in there, they would massacre everything yeah. in a matter of hours, I think. They are savage than anything. So what, you've got Incredible. four of them in there, have you? Four of them in yeah, there. Oh, yeah, there's one over there as well, yeah, look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there, there's the three that I've got. They're all, they're all rescued, right? They're, they're not the best fish. They shouldn't really be in the hobby. Yeah. Um, but they're here, and they're alive. So what am I going to do? Do you know what I mean? I'm not the sort of... I, I, like to look after the guys, so I might as well give them somewhere to live. Yeah, of course. Well, it's um, not like you've imported them yourself, is it? No, exactly that, like yeah. I was saying to you. you know, they're, they're all fish that come from small fish tanks. Um, yeah. And I'm not really in the business of euthanizing something that I can look after. No, that's right. Um, I, you know, it's, unfortunately, there's a time and a place for it in the hobby, um, but I don't think it's that when, when they can be homed and housed properly. Mm. Um, so I've done with the intentions of the good pond. Um, this actually came about because of a leak in a fish tank, so I had these guys in a tank outside kind of testing the theory. I've had them down as low as six degrees. Yeah. Um, they don't feed that low. Um, so I think they're a lot like the world's catfish. Yeah, so they're more docile, do they? Yeah, I think, I mean, I'm a, I, I've went into my, I'm fishing in all its forms, so I fish as well, um, mm. and I'm well into my world's catfish. And they are, they, you won't catch them in the winter, you know, the odd one you do, but you don't catch them in the winter. Uh, they just switch up because the water's cold. Yeah, yeah. Um, but in the summer, they're absolutely ravenous. And I think it'll be the same for them. Their natural temperature ranges in the US are much colder than our winter averages. Yeah. Um, you know, there's, there's some research to the theory, you know, there's some madness to it. Um, and it's the beauty of running over filtration, you know, it's a massive koi field. Yeah, it's huge, isn't it? Um, what what, what makes it? I actually, I, I don't know. It was uh, funny enough came from Michael. Yeah, how about Gareth? Yeah, I know, yeah. Um, but it's got a big UV bulb in it. It was great. I need a new pump on there, but it's literally, as I say, it was, it was literally like an emergency this week, which is why I was going to pull. Yeah. Um, but I think I'm going to just keep them in there for a little bit longer. I've got Pete and Abel's look over the fence and go, oh, he's set up a swimming pool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't want to go swimming in it. Nah. <laughs> I might have 32 degrees next weekend, so I might have to put a divider in there. Yeah, yeah, get in it with me, yeah, yeah. yeah oh, mate, they, here, have your toes off this one. <laughs> yeah, no, I wouldn't want to put my hand anywhere near him. No. Nah. It was literally, like, it was crazy because it was... But acclimatising is always interesting because you're also taking it down for quite a warm temperature. Yeah. They so got the guy to turn the heater off in the morning um, and then put him in here in the evening. It was kind of down from 28 to 18 in a day. Yeah, it's a lot, it isn't it? It says a lot, don't get me wrong, but it says a lot about the fish. Right? Oh, they're hard as anything. I think these are slightly younger on the fossil record than um, the long they've got. I might be wrong with that, but they've still been around for about 100 million years. That's why they're um, still around, mate. So they've lived through ice ages, they've lived through all sorts, you know. Yeah. Um, they've, uh, and Again, predators obviously in here with some snacks, I think I guess is the way to put it. Yeah. Uh, they've, they've, you know, fish have been eating fish for a long time before we were around, they're going to do it for a long time afterwards. So. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, so we're bloody entertaining to watch, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I bet. <laughs> do you, where'd you get these from the canal? Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, they only take a few at a time. Yeah, yeah. Um, and they, you know, they might eat one or two a week. Um, but pretty, yeah, some of them have been in there for quite a while now. There's a couple of chub and stuff in there. Mm. Um, a couple of little sturgeon in there. As I say, I've got access to a. Um, 30,000 litre koi pond, so if anything was to kind of go wrong, the sturgeon would go straight away, they're straight in there. Yeah, um, yeah. And the gar, I've got a couple of other temporary setups because ultimately I'm going to have to try and, well, I'm going to build a pond for them. There's just a little sound to it, depends on kind of what the plans are for the midterm of the house for how big a pond I want to build. Yeah, and how, e how easy it to move. Minute, mate. Yeah. yeah, I know. Mate, their towels are lovely, aren't they? Mate, as well? They're unbelievable. They are, aren't they? I, 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 I don't mean it like uh, they're as good as any sort of gar I've seen in the country mm. because they're unnatural. And I don't mean that, I'm not saying it to brag, I've read it from a lot of people that I've dealt with, that I deal with, you know, they are wonderful fish. Yeah. Their colours are, you know, in a tank they were, they were gorgeous. Yeah. They're, they're yeah. more of a gold, you know. 
Um, whereas you see them quite often and they're pretty dulled out in colours. This guy has ripped up, you can see on his tail where he's, where he's netted recently. Mm. Um, and he's got a bit, you can see the white marks on him in his nose, um, where he's been sort of banging the glass in the tank he was in before. I had a real problem with the one to the right, the smaller one in the shop. Um, you can see the, the white slightly, but it's, it's more of a scar tissue on the end of his nose. Right, yeah. Um, took me probably about two months to get him back to health, where, yeah. where he'd um, just been in a small tank and been banging his nose so much, he was right down to the bone. Yeah, it's stress, man. Red raw, had green, like, it was literally a green rot, like green, so he had yeah. algae growing over the top yeah, of the scar tissue. It was disgusting. Yeah. Absolutely disgusting. Um, so, yeah, various different types of treatment. I mean, the beauty with them is that they're air breathers. So you can kind of just throw them in a tank, throw yeah. a lot of treatment in there because they're not breathing it. Yeah. And you can kind of dose them up pretty heavy. Mm. Um, but again, they're so hardy because they've been around for such a long time. They're not, you know, other than things like the, the, the rot and, and from, bad, from truly bad treatment, yeah. um, they, they, you don't really catch anything else with them. They're kind of immune to it. They've been there, done that, got the T-shirt. Yeah. They survived dinosaurs. There's nothing too bad around now. <laughs> no, that's right. It's only us lot now. Yeah, isn't it? awesome. Yeah. Man. No, I love them. I absolutely love them. It's really something, something about the way they move. They're just so slow. But I think when they take food, oh, different ball game, yeah, isn't it? It's, it's yeah. lightning quick. Absolutely yeah. lightning quick. They, they sort of surprise them, don't they? It's not very really family friendly, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, but they are absolutely savage of anything when they want to be. Um, you can see the, the silverfish there come up to, to break the surface and shoot straight back down because yeah. you know what it's like. So it's coming up now, I think, down the guy in the middle, you see it come up for air. Yeah, yeah. So they come up and they're, they're really cool to watch. It will prolong it now because we're talking about it. Yeah, yeah. It's so yeah, slow, and it? It's just like, I ain't in no rush yeah, for no one, mate. Yeah, he's like, <laughs> yeah. So, so they do, they get, they'll come up. This one, it, look, look. Is he going to do it? So, they're all four of them have to be there. Yeah. Now the camera's out, none of them are <laughs> sure. Um, but it's been great for them in here because you know, they've had such small setup, so you can see that their, their genuine excitement of being in there. Yeah. Like this oh, the, mate, this is huge for them, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. It's Massive, good. It's four and a half thousand litres of water. And what would you pay for this, this pond sort of thing? 115 litres. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> what, what? So I'm going to box frame it off with some decking, yeah. um, which is about 200 quid worth of stuff. Yeah. The reason I'm doing that, and actually, I suppose contrary to the, the sort of popular belief where having it deep is best for the winter, mm. it's going to be cheaper to heat it or to at least interest. So what I'll probably do is like I did last year is run some heaters in the Yeah, the in, pump, in so It just keeps the keeps it kind of above six or seven. Yeah. Um, which is all it really needs to be and it just keeps them moving. He's coming up here now on the left. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Check yeah, that out, man. Quality. Oh, it's wicked, isn't so it? Yeah, mate, and they love it. Like, oh. they, they didn't, they couldn't do that in the tank. Right? Yeah, so yeah. Since they've been in here, they come up and they do big circles and they get air. It's proper like, so cool, proper man. over-exaggerated. It's really nice. Uh, it was a proper bit like, because I, um, yeah, I'm, uh, as you can see, very keen on my fish. So it was really nice to put them in there because they, they genuinely appreciate it. So it's cool. Oh man, you're making me want to get something like this, man. I, I've had a few people <laughs> say that. Yeah. A few people. As soon as, uh, people when you t most people, you sort of tell them and they're like, oh, you can't do that, they're tropical fish. Yeah. It's like they're not. Just because that's what they're just because that's what they bought at doesn't mean yeah, that's of course. they are, do you know what I mean? So mate, mate, the Mississippi River goes on and forever. on and on, yeah, doesn't yeah. it? I mean, the long you think how many different temperatures it goes through? Yeah, the, the long lows that I've got inside eventually will be out here as well. Yeah. Um, they, they're up in Lake Erie, which yeah. is like the Canadian border. So it, that is so much better. Yeah, yeah. there's a fly there, look, 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 look. <laughs> Let's see what happens. See if they're brave enough. Yeah. I think a little fish might pick it. Pick it. There's a couple of chub in there, they're all a little bit aggressive. The thing is, they just get, they, they are, you can see a few of the, the silver was scratched up. They just know if they come up, they, they're just susceptible to attack yeah. from the Yeah, of course. Flies. You're safe in a show, <laughs> aren't you? Um, yeah, yeah. So it does the job, mate. It's, it's nice. And as I say, I box it off, it's, it gives me a bit of time. Unfortunately, yeah. the, um, it's always the way with the hobby, right? The bathroom needs to. Oh yeah. Um, so that's kind of put the pond on hold this year. I know mate. There's always something. There's always something. There's yeah. the home ownership, right? Yeah, and cars. Thank God's all the car. Yeah, I love that. So yeah, yeah. and uh, uh, get a new car three months ago, which was great. Yeah, yeah. Ah, it's quality, mate. Honestly, I love it, mate. It's nice, so cool. mate. It's awesome. Absolutely awesome. I bet, I bet you just sit out here, don't you? Yeah, drink a drink beer yeah. and just... Yeah, that's, mate. As I was say, I came out here last night and I got back from the pub, turned the lights on the Saturday and the pipe. Yeah, I bet you did. I bet you did. So, so, you, so once it's boxed off, be, it's, it's deceptive, and um, I think I might even throw a liner in it. Yeah. Because I'm going to insulate the sides of King's frame. Um, and it's well, yeah, those, it's sort of a decking board stuff frame, yeah. Yeah, literally. Yeah. Um, just just with, de with decking boards and get some King's frame on the inside of it. Yeah, so th this is possibly 150. What was the filter? Fill 
Uh, race race, I did very well on that. Yeah, um, so, so I would knew that would probably set you back about seven hundred quid. Seven hundred quid, yeah, uh, but you need, but you do I've, need that, don't you? Oh, mate, I had it run every day. I had that. I love overfiltration. You can never have too much. Yeah, that's so right. I had that running on the seven by two by two. But the beauty of that was knowing that as soon as I ever went bigger, whatever that was going to be, yeah, like to plug that straight in. So I do need to get a new pump. I'm going to say it's literally been running since like Tuesday. Yeah, um, it's so, all cycled in, ready to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I do need to get a new pump just to run that out to the middle. Um, you see the perch around the back as well, the perch are beautiful fish. I've got to say, if you're like after a budget fish or you're worried about um, heating bills, etc., they are the best predatory fish I've ever had. The perch, yeah. Mate, they are. Oh, they look like on, a, a mono peacock bass, bass, don't they? Bass. they yeah. are unbelievable. Yeah. And they are savage as anything. Really? They are, yeah, they love. Um, let me go and get some, get some open. Yeah, let's have a watch, yeah. man. Hey, this is incredible. I need to do something like this. What do you guys think of these? Not quite as keen on the maggots, I don't think. You'll see it. They're definitely maggots. It's not a piece on the ground. Still a little bit scared of the gar, aren't they? The perch aren't as bad around the gar because they fight back. Yeah. No, like they've got a bit of attitude to them, do you know what I mean? Mm. Um, I've seen, the, I've had seen the guy with one before. Um, what in his mouth? Fought out, yeah, he got himself out of there. Right? Yeah, yeah. Which is nice, they're never have to turn up their cool fish, they're really good fish. Cool. Yeah, that's all gone, they've done that. Yeah, it's got to be done, man. Uh, they have to get a worm farm or something, isn't it? They're a bit more effective for them normally. I don't know they will or not. No, they're just... Uh, yeah. They kind of they have to get themselves into a bit of a frenzy, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Once, once one of them goes, they'll all go. But they're a bit shy, I think. They're pretty docile during the day as well. Mm. They're very much a dawn to dusk thing. Um, no, but, sorry, dawn and dusk, they're very active. I was going to say, it's a great film. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, they're very active, but they're a bit quieter during the day normally. It's quite a warm day today as well, actually. Yeah, it's well off. Like 25, there, so. isn't it? But again, no, I, I won't do the water changes on that so much, just because it's going to cost so much more to do it, you know? Yeah, of course, of course. Well, you must get a, a hell of a, a lot of evaporation on this as well. Yeah, that's the thing. I suppose it in the winter you won't have to worry about that, right? Um, yeah. But I, I definitely just defend it. I mean, I love the billy, but it's just... Oh, yeah. Quite a nice little... Once you look in it, you know, as I say, from the outside, it looks like a kid's pool. But once you look in it, it's quite a cool. It's like a big kid's pool once you look in it. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, <laughs> of course, yeah. Mate, I love it. I think Mate, it's well good. It's one of those things. And it's cost you, like, next, next to nothing. nothing. Right. Next to nothing. I mean, and you've got some... The pumps, even the pumps are old, but... That was the whole point of the tank, to be honest. Like, like I said, you, I paid 100 quid for the tank and the 7x2x2 two two that they were in. Mm. Um, and the two of the car um, and I've delivered to here so I paid that and it was all I paid for that I built the stand out of breeze blocks and just some um, plywood that I had lying about yeah. I kind of did it as a bit of a challenge because I kind of went the other way with the tank inside and spent a fortune yeah yeah um, yeah but that's but internal isn't it so yeah, yeah, yeah of course it is you, yeah. you, you, God, you're looking at it aren't you all you the time you can't, you, you can't go cheap on something you're going to have in the house no. far too much water um, like I said, that had a leak in it, and I resealed it, and it was all right for a period of time. Yeah. But when it's sitting out on the patio, if it all does go wrong, it's not the end of the world. No, that's right. That's um, right. So I wasn't too bothered about it, but no. I wouldn't have that anyway near uh, my um, job. Mate, on Monday, yeah, I, I said to the missus, right, I'm going to go upstairs and start editing one of the videos. I'm filling the tank up, the 10 foot tank, yeah. So keep an eye on it. Give, let me know when it's near enough full. She's got all about it. She goes, what's that water noise? Come downstairs, the hose has still been going, all the electric's gone off. Because the, the water dripped all the way down the tank, went into one of my wave pumps, the plug. The water has gone all over my TV cabinet. That's how far it's gone. Whoa. Because she, she didn't notice the tank was overflowing. I went, no! Couldn't believe it. That's really lucky. Mate, honestly. That could have been really dangerous. Yeah, it? yeah, yeah it could have been. Oh. Could have killed all the fish and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I took apart, it's an MP40 Ecotech. Oh, right, yeah. It's the controller. I took it apart, it was saturated. Hair dried it, um, put it in a bag of rice. Fine. Yeah. It's alright, it's <laughs> fine. No, it's good. It's, it's, yeah. I think the um, and that that was probably 
I don't know, say 200 litres in the floor then? Not 2,000 yeah, litres, yeah. yeah. No, absolutely. Yeah. And honestly, we were towering it up, sweeping it out the door. I guess sometimes I have to keep an eye on that one. I run the hose just from the, um, from the kitchen tap, it's so much easier. Yeah, that's um, it. But you have to keep an eye on it because it sometimes sort of falls out and I've had it a couple of yeah, times I've come yeah. in and it's like, and the problem is because I've had to take the floorboards out, I can get underneath the floorboards so I'm sort of sitting there pushing the floorboards down trying to get the power yeah. to the, the, the wood flooring. Oh, it all swelled up, didn't it? Yeah. Now, nah, Walker makes some serious damage, mate. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I'm just saying, like, I, I, this will be, I'm sure you'll come and see it as they grow out in the future. This will yeah. probably look pretty different, it'll be boarded off. Oh, I'm, mate, and I can't wait to see what these look oh, like. Mate, I am seriously excited about that fish. Yeah. yeah that, that is. Um, it's the biggest one, I mean, other than kind of, you know, I've seen them in sort of sea world and stuff. Hmm. It's the biggest one I've seen in the flesh, it's massive. I know there's a few big platinums about it. Yeah, yeah, have you seen my mate Jamie's I've one? I've seen the, yeah, that's yeah, a serious seen, fish, isn't it? Yeah, go, I'll, I'll pop it up. I've seen a video, no, yeah, he's tanks awesome. It. Yeah, yeah, it's a good video. It's yeah. probably, I it's, love his filtration setup. You know? Yeah, it's wicked, isn't it? So I was on the phone to Gareth the other day, I was like, you've got to watch that video. Yeah. That geezer's on for something. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. It, 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 oh, it's, it's so easy. Mate. Uh, it's all about ease, I think. Yeah. You, you're better off paying that a little bit more, or even just doing something slightly different yeah. to, to save your time. I've, I've learned a lot of him over the years. Yeah, honestly, he's, 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 he's taught me a lot. No, he's a great bloke. Honestly, you should get in contact with him if you want to go and see his stuff. Yeah, because he's, sure, yeah, he's only local as well, isn't he? And it's, it's, yeah, he's, he's sort of Essex sort of way. There's, a, there's, a, there's, there's definitely a growing thing, isn't it? There's definitely more people doing yeah, it. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. More, more nutters more getting about. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're all pretty more mad, aren't we? It's weird yeah. that you have to be, didn't you? It's one yeah. the other, isn't it? Like, of course. Well, like, you, you're you all in. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You can't, you, it's not the, once you get to kind of this end of the hobby, you, right. you're all in or you're not. Yeah. Um, you, you get your 6x2, didn't you? And you either stay with your 6x2 or you go to the 10 foot tank, didn't you? And the 9 foot tank. And that's, what I said to, that's what I said to George when we did it, when this is it. It's just, you can't, like, there's no point in Because you, you, even by, for, for a decent 6x2, you, you're still looking at paying 1500 yeah, quid, right? Yeah. So I said, what I don't want to do is put a fish tank there and think, God, there's so much more room for a fish tank. Well, yeah. Which is exactly what I would have done. Yeah, just fill, um, the, fill the room, mate. Yeah, so we're, yeah. You know, there's plastic in place. We, we moved up from, we, I lived in, um, I went to the up. I moved up this way, it's a little bit further up, just to get a bit more money, a bit more value for money. Yeah, of course, yeah, yeah. Um, but did it with the intention of having somewhere with the space to get a big fish tank. Yeah, that's right. I was always at home. My, my parents were quite fortunate to have a big house at home in there. Always thought I'd back, my parents had a sort of a back living room. Yeah. Always wanted to get a big yeah, fish yeah. tank across yeah. the wall. Yeah, that's what I did. always, when you do it, well, yeah, you can do it when you get your own house. Yeah, you can do it when you that's, get your own that's house. Yeah. And the problem is, now I've got my own house, I do things like this should have gone. I had the perfect house at my mum and dad's, and I said, can we, can we get a tank there? Can we get a tank there? All I had was a 250 litre tank, and so it let me out. Yeah, me too. I moved straight, yeah. straight into a flat years ago, and I got a 6x2x2, two two, and I was like, I thought it was the biggest tank in the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. And then got the house, and I ordered the template tank straight away. Yeah, that was, mate, literally, I think we'd, um, we'd been in for about two months. And my missus was just like, go and then we'll go up and order it. Yeah, yeah. There's quite a few quotes on it. Hard to, they're harder to get than you think. And obviously, you've got MD and they're great. And, uh, and I yeah. had them looked at, I did get a couple of quotes off of them. I just, the way it, they quote, I had a quote for one thing and then they changed it and it just, because someone had obviously calculated it with a different stand or whatever. Yeah, yeah. But it, the jump was so significant that I was like, you know what, I'm going to go with Wharf because it just it kind of almost doubled in price. Yeah. Um, which is completely fair enough. And, you know, you get the boss stand finish and, and that's, they are lovely, lovely things. Mm. Yeah, they're both, both great companies. That Wharf for, um, for the fish is fantastic as well, yeah, isn't it? You know? there's a few, there's a few, there's a few that's on Facebook, right? And I mean, I've seen sort of people, like some little horror stories, people that put big deposits down the tank. Yeah. And they just never turned up. Yeah. Um, what, from, what, from Wharf? No, no, not Wharf. No, 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 no. Oh. From, um, from some of the ones online. Right, so, right. So if you know, like, some of the top hits on Google, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, you actually I've, look into the reviews, it's almost like one in two people actually gets their fish tank. Yeah, I've, I've heard there's another company, my, another bloke I filmed the other day, and he said, he paid all up front and they went bust. Can't remember yes, the name. Yeah, I think I've the, the same name. one, but, they, yeah. they, but it, there was about, from what I'd seen, I think it was about 17 or 18 people got caught Terrible, up mate. Awful. That's, like, you're probably looking at 40 odd grand worth of fish yeah. there, you know? That's why you're better off sticking to like, proper companies like India yeah, and Wolf, absolutely, mate. Yeah, absolutely. You know, you know they've been about for years. There's nothing else. You know where they are. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> you know, you know they, they've got a reputable brand, they've got a shop, there's somewhere to go and talk to somebody. Yeah, exactly. And that's the, you know, that's the cool thing about doing it, right? I'm sure you're the same, the, the almost consultation that you get when you go to yeah. see them. Yeah, You know, you're buying oh, something proper, do you know what so I mean? Exciting, so exciting, yeah. yeah. cool. Yeah. You kind of get taken through the back door yeah. into, the, yeah. into the tank building. Room, yeah. It's like, yeah, and you're like, when can you do it? I want it now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I think I've got mine in eight weeks, which, yeah. considering how the
Yeah, I've got him. Well, anyway, Paul, thanks so much for having me over, mate. You're welcome, mate. It's, nice um, to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. It's crazy, mate. Honestly, you should Appreciate be proud it. of it. Yeah, I am. I am. It'll be nice. I'll, uh, I'll get you some pictures over once it's got a wooden frame around it. It's going to go into the flower. Yeah, bed, definitely, mate. Well, we'll stay in touch and um, I'm sure we'll do another video at some point. Yeah. But anyway, guys, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel. Ping the notification bell and keep it real, everyone.